Adam, you've been here for a few months now. How have you found how have you found it initially? Yeah, it's a, obviously a great club. Um, I love the setup here. Boys are brilliant, and you know we just need to get some results. And um, you know I can't really ask for more. It's a it's a good start, and um, I've settled in well. Um, but yeah, we need we need to start winning on the pitch now and, and getting some points. I mean, you played the last two now and uh, and scored against Chesterfield after taking off uh, Sam Granville. Uh, can you talk us through that? Yeah, um, obviously, from my perspective, uh, Sam's had a shot from the edge of the box, and I've, you know, just instinct, instinct, um, put my foot out, and you know, it's gone in nicely. And I think half the boys noticed it was my goal, half didn't. And uh, lucky enough, I think it's gone down as my goal now. So, as a striker, you need you need goals to get the confidence, and hopefully, now getting the first, I can get a few more under my belt now. I mean, how are you feeling personally after taking a, a knock to the face uh, against Chesterfield? Yeah, absolutely fine. Um, I got a whack to the whack to the nose just before half time. That you know, it's a bit a bit annoying. I kept having to go off the pitch and a bit frustrating. But now, yeah, absolutely fine. And hopefully, hopefully, I'll be fine to play Saturday. And looking ahead to Bromley tomorrow, what are you expecting from it? Yeah, another tough test. Um, you know, it's on 4G as well, which obviously probably benefits them having playing. They're obviously playing on it all season. But um, you know, we'll we'll go there. We'll go there. Um, you know, believing in ourselves, I think the last few games have been been frustrating, really, because we haven't played bad. It was just uh, haven't accumulated the points. Um, but yeah, we we go there, um, believing in ourselves, and hopefully tomorrow's the day we can pick up three points. We, we showed real fight and determination to to come from two goals down against Chesterfield, um, against against a, a team that's going to be up at the top of the season. That must give us confidence going into tomorrow. Yeah, exactly. We could have uh, gone under and it could have been four or five. Um, but no, we, we battled well. Um, we showed resilience and we showed teams to togetherness. And yeah, I think, you know, at one point there, half time, it could have gone either way. So it's a bit frustrating. Obviously, we ended up on the receiving end of the, the scoreline. But I think, yeah, we, we need to we need to keep going and, and um, you know, the three points won't be far away. I mean, our supporters will be, should be there on their numbers tomorrow. Have you got a message for them? Yeah, obviously to remain patient if you can, and uh, obviously we're we're trying to. I think I think you can see we're trying to put it, put in our best performances, trying to you know give a hundred percent, and um, you know it's frustrating for everyone. We're all working as hard as we can, and yeah, just to stay with us, um, be loud and and proud behind the goal, and I'm sure we we can get the three points.